Hello, in this quest video, I am going to show you how to have multiple screens, not in immersed VR or in virtual desktop or in, you know, Oculus Link or anything like that, literally just on here. So, first of all, you see my screen, my window that I've got here, I'll, I'll close this one down and I'll open up the app library usually it's probably down here so you might be thinking how did i get it up there so there's a few things that you can do see these little bars here you can move stuff up and down like so the bottom one is less interesting and that just allows you to really just change the baseline height predominantly but this one if i keep it pressed you can do this with hand tracking as well you, know, you just pinch on it but i'm just going to do it with a controller because i find it easier if i use you know the in my index figure to grab it and um, push it up it brings it up to a bigger display one that's better anyway so that's step number one step number two is if i hover over it and i press my you know this button here which is the middle my middle finger to that button there and i hover over this window it can be pressed now i can select it and move it left and right so if let's say if i put that to the left maybe i want the app library there and next i'm going to open up the store store has now opened up in the center the store generally has like a wider sort of window that's just naturally the way it is and let's say if i want to do the same thing with that grab it pin it over there which is fantastic and now let's say in the middle i'm gonna see if i've got a web browser uh, stores over there Oh, app library is over here. Do I have a web browser? If not, I can just whack on YouTube to demonstrate the last one. I'll whack on YouTube. So, YouTube, where was it? It's not installed, but I can't see it taking too long. Yeah, that's a pretty small file that will be done in a few seconds. So, we'll open that up and we'll pin it in the center so it's almost done and like i said you just hover over it press the middle uh you know your middle finger where that naturally sits and you know i can put it there so that's overridden this and it's basically swapped over the, the what's it called the windows Uh, in my bed, so with this one, I with this one that was so. Let me reopen stuff. I'll move this over here. I'll open up the store. And finally, let's say if I open up, what could I open up? That'll definitely open up there. And uh, so, let's say if I open up you know, settings, for example. And the settings will open up in the same window. My bad. I'm going to open up the app library again. I'll open up people. There we go. So, so we can open all this up. We can go to the settings of this people tab. So we could do have these multiple windows. Grab it. And like I said, you can swap them around. It's fantastic. So let's say I've got some you know, chat stuff over here. I've got my app library over here. And maybe I just want to browse the app store and have a look, you know, what game I want to play. And, you know, I want to look at what's already my library in general. And then maybe I'm talking to someone as well. So that is pretty darn cool. So that's basically how you do it. And if you keep this press, so if I pinch on that or like drag that, you can drag this whole thing around so if you want that then that goes all the way around now again it's not very comfortable that way and you could you know make it a little higher a little lower if i put it down you'll go to just the one window if i put it back up it restores all windows if i click this one you can make it go down higher so if you want it higher like up there you can do that so i can look at it like that honestly it's not very good that way i was gonna have it back here and realign it to the center and that's it i am using a oculus or a meta quest pro but you can do this with the quest 2 and the quest 1 so feel free to you know check this out if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comments there's also a link in the description to the discord page where there's a whole community of over 8,000 members so you can you know interact there let me know what 
you know, MetaQuest Pro or MetaQuest videos you want to see next. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. I'll see you soon. Bye bye.